What's good, everybody? It's on the real the God Slayer. I'm a real gamer. We're back in more Fallout 4. Today, we're going to head out into Diamond City and get this story on the road. Uh, we have Piper, of course, here. Lovely Piper. Um, just to give you a little overview of where we stand in terms of our weapons and armor. Um, I'm using road leathers because I have the ballistic weave on them uh, i don't i have the the mock the mk3 version so this is what i'm looking at now uh i need ballistic fiber i can i have the ability to get the the, the max version but i need ballistic fiber in order to do it and like ballistic fiber i know you can get around like military areas but i haven't like really come across enough to get to the last version uh i'm using right now a, a leather polished chest piece a let it polished chest piece here I'm using a uh, mutant slayers polymer combat leather combat armor uh, left uh, leg of course gives me 15% reduced damage from super mutants same thing for this ghoul slayers version that gives me a 15% damage resistance against ghouls uh, this the bolstered polished uh, metal right arm gives me Greater damage uh, increases my uh, resistance against uh, damage, uh, ballistic and energy damage and stuff. The lower my health gets, so the lower my health, the harder it will be to kill me, up to 35, plus 35, you know, and that's just, you know, not taking account the 230 ballistic and the 204 at the bottom there. Uh, I also have a ballistic weave on my hat, my fedora hat. Which adds more, more to that there uh, and I'm using uh, this one here it uh, reduces damage for, for robots as well for the synthetic of course I keep on my love's wedding ring you know and I always keep a hazmat suit on me just in case I gotta do something that's you know super super radioactive I always keep this on me um, in terms of weaponry, we are working with, of course, the Deliver. The, uh, Criminal's Tooth, whenever we do get, you know, melee started up. The Hair Bustle. Okay, we got the Hair Bustle. Alright, for now we got, you know, we gonna use this one when it comes to the Hair Bustle there. And use that for now. I think I'm gonna actually change the uh, sight on that real quick because, oh lord, that sight on that weapon is rough. Let me see. So what I'm using now is 82. Dang, that drops my. That drops the damage. Yeah, we'll just keep it. We'll keep it for now. Um, the Cosmic Universal Truth, which is uh, a combat shoddy that came with the uh, legendary perk of improved vats. Which we, uh, we boosted up. The Long Death which is a, I turned it into a 308 sniper rifle that shoots an additional projectile, so it does lots of good damage there. And of course our deliver. And that's what we're rolling with there. Uh, on Piper, oop. real quick on Piper. Hey. Shoot. Sure, take a peek. She has on ballistic weave armor uh, top, a uh, he helmet. She's using uh, this one here. Her weapon is the Lady Luck. I took a 
I love how the, how this particular gamma weapon allowed me to use both energy and ballistic damage. And so I, I took that as the as as the basis for Piper's uh, attack style. And it uses plasma cartridges, which isn't a lot, but the way this one is set up, it's, a, it's set up as a sniper rifle, and uh, it does it does pack a, a wallop. So she won't be having to spam a lot of shots in terms of kill to kill with it. Uh, that, of course, her. And uh, this is what I'm going to give her to use whenever she runs out of that main weapon. She'll end up using this. Um, I named it Poison Ivy, but it basically is a poisoning weapon. And of course, I already tested to see if, if, if she would just normally use that without giving her 10 millimeter rounds, and she won't. Even though they resort to a 10 millimeter gun, so hence they have a, a, a infinite amount of 10 millimeter rounds, they won't use uh, the 10 millimeter pistol you give them unless there is 10 millimeter rounds. So I've already tried that. Uh, of course, that one, that chess piece, and I also keep her wearing the other wedding ring, you know, because you know she's our new bae. All right, Piper, let's roll. Uh, oh yeah, when it comes to the Commonwealth, I have connected the Commonwealth in a weird like pincer style, where where everything connects to Sanctuary from one side. And then it connects from the from the other side down through south, all the way around. So we have the we have that all connected. This is from another. This is from a mod. So I don't even care about that being there. That's from a mod for real. But uh, other than that, we are fully ready. No real mods to affect our combat, and in any sorts and fashion. I'm not using any like invincible mods or anything like that. Of course and the only thing I really did was just a mod that allows me to use ballistic weave on on things that I couldn't normally use it on like the like the road leathers and stuff like that I can use it on that stuff like that so that Piper could be looking sexy with her with her role with her role warrior outfit on come on Piper let's roll girl all right First and foremost, let me do this. Uh, let's travel. Well, first, let's do this. Let's, uh... Oh, yeah. we The Nuka War thing, I'm not going to continue that for this playthrough. Because the Nuka World, they, it will lead me into basically raiding my own settlements here as a raider. And I don't want to fuck that up. So I'm not going to continue that here. Uh, where is... Yeah, we want to do that, but first thing we want to do is we want to go to the slog and see what they got going on over there, because apparently they got, apparently they got trouble. Apparently they got trouble over there. a good supply of clean water things would be pretty good you hear about that farm run by ghouls isn't that something wait a second let me guess I just want to trade a few things. <clears throat> I'm glad you're here. We've been having some trouble with raiders. Tell me what's going on. They showed up in force a few days ago. There were too many of them. We had to give them what they wanted. They said as long as we kept paying them tribute, they'd leave us alone. At least we know where they're hiding out. Here, I'll mark it on your map. 
Don't worry. I'll take care of those raiders for you. Thanks. It will be a relief not to have to worry about them. All right. Now we've got that quest going on. Now we can go back to Diamond City. Diamond City. Here we come. Good to be back, ain't it, Piper? Okay, let's first and foremost get a... Uh... God damn! Hold on. Ugh. All right, we can. Uh, I can at least probably show you. Good fight. Yeah. I want to trade a few things. Okay. Well, you're good. Don't worry. I'm not worried about you. Okay, y'all good? Okay, y'all good. All right, shit. All right, now back to Diamond City. <laughs> what the hell's going on with y'all? Read the paper, mister. Trust me. Nat. Hey, mister. That interview you did with Piper is really selling. Here's your free coffee. Okay. Piper! Your sister down here. Alright, let's go. News from the Commonwealth. Hey, you were in the paper, right? You're 200 years old? Looking pretty good for your age, huh? Officer? I ain't telling you how to pick your friends, but Piper's kind of a troublemaker. Swatters, right here. Best skull bashes in the Commonwealth. Don't walk outside the wall undefended. High quality protection for sale. <coughs> Sometimes you gotta wonder, does anyone fight back? 
Institute has to have enemies, right? What? You mean the railroad? Well, that's a fairy tale, man. They don't exist. Nah, I heard from my cousin. He knows a guy that works for him. They got a code phrase and everything. You, you can't Follow shop here. Diamond City Surplus does not exist. What the hell is that supposed to mean? I keep telling you're full of it. That kind of talk is going to get you smashed up by the sense. You think you're human, but that's just because the Institute has programmed you that way. Look at that nose of yours. It's not a human nose. We got small arms, long arms, ammunition. You're that vault dweller from the paper. We buy and sell everything to everyone except sense. No sense allowed here. Wow. Lots of racism going on. Ellie, are you here? Nick? Oh, God, it's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday, death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time then, do you? Yes. You know Actually, them, yes. You deserve a reward. Here. From a rainy day fund. Plus a little something extra. You know, if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much, but I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team, professionals kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. What else can you tell me? We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. It's a lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. Anything else you remember? My wife was murdered. She was trying to keep them from taking Sean, and they, they just. It's OK. You don't need to say anything more. So we're talking about a group of cold hearted killers, but they waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. Anything else you remember? We're looking for my son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Now that confirms it. <coughs> this isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners. And of course, there's the Institute. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. Discarded prototype, anyway. You're a prototype? As far as I know. Never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal. And there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? One of them came right up to me. Bald head. 
scar across his left eye. Wait, it couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? But who is he? Do you think he has Char? Hmm. It's way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. It's Sean. It has to be. Somehow. Don't jump the gun on me. You said you were looking for an infant, remember? That's over nine years difference by my count. Look, maybe he has a son of his own. Maybe it's someone else's kid. Either way, they both vanished a while back. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. All right. <clears throat> Let's go, Nick. Come on, Piper. Nick Valentine, boy, look at him. I didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance, bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies, because they're all dead. Except you. Nine to one odds says he's our man more than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later? Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. That's one heck of a lock. Got something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Lock's really strong. No Nick. Stubborn lock, ain't it? See that platform in the distance, near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. All right, let's go to the mayor's. Need some custom hardware? We got a free workbench. Heard you rescued Valentine. Good work. Let's get the hell out of me. Who needs a haircut? He ain't like those instant psychos. Step up. Read all about it. An outsider's perspective on Diamond City. Are we still the green jewel? Come on, Piper. Sex itself, girl. The mayor's receiving visitors as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? I need 
talk to someone about Kellogg's old house in the West Stands. Mr. Kellogg's residence? He left town a while ago. We foreclosed on the property and locked it up. If there was something belonging to the man that you have a claim on, you could ask the mayor to hear you out. No guarantees. Come on. Can't you help me yourself? And if I could, why should I? Just trust me. It's important. You have my word. Well, you do have an honest face, and it's not like there's anything important in an abandoned house. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this, but what the hell? Here you go, honey. Now, don't do anything in that place I wouldn't do. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Come on, Piper. Girl, you almost. Girl, you almost walked off the edge and just died on yourself. Huh? Look at my baby girl, Piper. All right. Too much dirt in that hair? Get it trimmed. You won't regret it. Don't be caught dead. <laughs> Protection from hey, Commonwealth so weaponry. Is there anything to help me, you know, impress someone? Try your hand at the game of love. Yeah, the railroad fights against the Institute. Uh, uh, Think you can find them. Follow the freedom trip. What's that supposed to mean? All right, let's head in. You do the honors. <clears throat> let's take a look around. Kellogg must have left something behind. Hmm. What's that for? Place seems small to you. Figured a guy like Kellogg would think big. here. Did you check out that desk? I'm telling you, something's not right. Look for anything out of sorts. A switch. A button. Oh! Well, that's one way to hide. Well, look at this. All of a Merc's favorite things. Oh, shit. Hey, Valentine. Well, look at that. All of Kellogg's favorite things. Gwinnett Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, cigars, San Francisco sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. I wonder if dog meat could pick up the scent. Say, that's not a bad idea. 
Some dogs out there in the Commonwealth can track a man for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. You can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Goodbye, Nick. Hopefully not forever. I want to see you and your kids safe and sound when you get back. Good luck. Anytime you need help, just come knocking. Heads up. You say the word. Take a look. <clears throat> okay, let's go. We gotta go see dog meat. We gotta go see dog meat. It's good to be back in Diamond City. Dog meat. Get the scent, boy. Got something, boy? Read about the man at a time. Ball Dweller wakes up after 200 years. Dog meat. Take me to my son, dog meat. San Francisco Sunlights. Kellogg's preferred brand, all right. Okay, boy, let's track him. It's amazing that dog meat just ended up in a diamond city. <laughs> Even though he I need to take that scope off that shotgun. I didn't mean to have that scope on the shotgun like that, to be quite honest, but 
I think this scope actually gives it more damage. This guy's a crack shot. Bloody bandages. Dog meat can track this. Hmm. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? Looks like this one thought he'd get away. No such luck. Dog meat's got something. See anything? <laughs> Gwyneth Stout. One of his creature comforts. Okay, boy, let's track him. Oh, wow.
Attacking known mercenary. Exercise extreme caution. Alert. What have Critical we here? Signs. Error. Alert. System corrupt. I can't feel my legs. What happened here? Error. Operator deceased. Threat level Omega. He killed us. We're still on track. Hopefully he's not much further. Damn, Piper. Violent girl. We had it, dog. What do you think, boy? Was this our man? Fort Hagen. Oh, hard to believe I'm roaming with my own pre-war relic. Is this the place? Is he in here, boy? This is it, isn't it? Kellogg's here. All right, Blue. It's you and me. I think dog meats earned some time off. Don't worry, dog meat. Just saying hello. Heads up. What can I do? Looking for something specific?
Okay. How in the world was he getting in here? Ah! That way. Alive. Don't mind the clutter. It looks like a door that it looks like a door to get in. No vent way to get in. Am I still in front of Fort Hagen? Yeah, I am.
that was that way. Ah! All right, Piper, here we go. Movement detected. Curious. Is someone present? Hostile sensor reading detected. The sensitivity of my sensors clearly needs adjustment. Well, if anyone could figure out. Broke. It's broke. No, no. 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 That's it. Initiated. Where'd they go? Oh, gone. Just like that. Primary sensor critically damaged. Good I was in error. No enemy detected. I am detecting Asset stealth power. activity. In danger. Defending. Bro! Sweet. 
I shot the wood. Ain't that a bitch? <sighs> I ended up shooting the wood. Fort Bacon is under institute authority. Terminating intruder. What's my, what's my right leg look like? Oh yeah. Size chained up. Bro, God. Termination is inevitable. Your termination is inevitable. Hey. 
the way. Nice. Bro! Nice. Chained on the other side. Back to the scrap heap for you. That's the first time I've died in a long time. Okay. Now we're ready. Hey. Probably have something you can use. All right. I'm uh, more than likely end up cutting all that part out that you probably won't see it. Uh, that's of me running around here getting everything back after I died. Uh, so yeah, I'll, I'll cut all that out for you there. Let's uh. Go ahead and do this while we're at it then.
is all this? Okay, so that's it. A whole perk just to be able to get in there. All right, let's go. That's hilarious. Hello, Psst, goodbye. Wandering through places Still like this is how people end up someone else's dinner. Detected. Curious. There you are. I have to hand it to him. These guys are a little tougher. Well, if anyone could figure out a good use for it. Yes. I see where we are now. Okay. Yeah, if it isn't my old friend, the frozen TV dinner. Last time we met, you were cozying up to the peas and apple cobbler.
Mm, bro. Sorry, your house has been a wreck for 200 years. But I don't need a roommate. Leave. I'm not leaving. I'm talking about this is closest I done got to you. Motherfucker who shot my wife. Kidnapped my kid. I ain't going nowhere. <laughs> expected you to come knocking on my door. Gave you 50-50 odds of making it to Diamond City. After that, figured the Commonwealth would chew you up like jerky. pick up the only synth I've met that didn't seem to have a screw loose. Wonder if that's why they got rid of him. Place is in surprisingly good shape, considering. Heads up. What you got for me? the best thing in the world but all right oh what the hell piper
Well, if anyone could figure out a good use for it. Okay, so it won't let me... No computer to to unlock that. None whatsoever. Okay. Look, you're pissed off. I get it. I do. But whatever you hope to accomplish in here, it's not gonna go your way. Security's too tight. Sensor reading. Did Blake has some serious defenses. Must be something important here. Good job, Piper. Kind of glad your gun works the way it does. Heavy as hell, I did. That's it. Okay.
show them. Oh, come on, let me carry something before you cripple yourself. No, I'm finna, I'm finna drop some shit right now. Wait a second. How you doing, girl? Is that the key? No way I'm cracking this. Okay, no, it's not. Okay. Sensor reading detected. It's not too late. Stop. 
turn around, and leave. You have that option. Not a lot of people can say that. Not happening, kill out. Come out, come out. Got it. Well, I would love to pick you up. Just ain't gonna work. Certainly seen better days, haven't it? for something specific okay
gotta be careful what I pick up now. Cause uh God dang it. Fuck it. Talk about clean. Let's, uh, talk. You murdering, kidnapping psychopath! Give me my son! Give me Sean! Now! Right to it then, huh? Okay. Fine. Your son Sean. Great kid. A little older than you may have expected. But I'm guessing you figured that out by now. But if you're hoping for a happy reunion... Ain't gonna happen, pal. Your boy's not here. God damn it, you mercenary motherfucker. Where is my son? What's the cliche? So close, but yet so far away? That's Sean. But don't worry. You'll die knowing he's safe and happy. A bit older than you expected, but ah well. At least he's in a loving home. The Institute. So where is it, huh? This Institute. How do I get there? <laughs> Haven't you been paying attention? You don't find the Institute. The Institute finds you. You open the closet. It's just a closet. You can never find the monster that hides inside. Not until it jumps out at you. But I think we've been talking long enough. We both know how this has to end. So, you ready? I'm going to make you suffer. <laughs> He just died.
refills your action points on a critical hit. Give me that. Strip your ass naked. Alright. Yes. Huh, wish I'd brought something to peruse myself. The boys shall not successfully deliver back to the Institute payment received. New orders to track down Renegade, gather reinforcements, clear out, clear it out and secure Fort Hagen. We move out soon. Okay. go ahead and end it here guys and in the next one we'll uh I'm, we'll uh we'll we'll go and uh then we gotta talk to who we gotta go and talk to nick yep we gotta go talk to nick so the next one we'll go talk to nick about what we found out but we popped kellogg and we got what we needed baby finally got revenge on my wife but now i got my new bay gotta move on i'm a relic the god slay on i'm a relic gamer now it's time to go get my son so we can be one big happy family. Piper, one big happy sexy family. And we out. People of the Commonwealth. Do not interfere. Our intentions are peaceful. We are the Brotherhood of Steel.